Hello guys, uh, my name is Ahmed Hali for the Unscripted Talks uh, here in uh, Dab Radio. Now, today I want us to focus on the celebrity couple uh, divorces and uh, breakups uh, that uh, we've witnessed uh, this month. Now, this month uh, we've had uh, not less than uh, three celebrity couples that have uh, broken up here in Kenya. To start with number one, the list of unexpected, the list of ex the completely opposite that people will expect. This is a comedian YY and uh, the wife uh, uh, Maria. Now, uh, it is so disheartening that um, most of these celebrity couples, uh, breakups that we are seeing, are the kind of, uh, you know, breakups that. Um, Andrew Kibe, I don't know, should we call Andrew Kibe the prophet of doom? <laughs> because actually, Kibe has predicted uh, so many of these uh, breakups. For instance, if I take down the clock, you remember when um, Otile Brown, uh, you know, was dating Vera Sidika, then uh, again Vera Sidika left Otile Brown as they broke up and went to uh, Brown Mauzo. And Andrew Kibble did say that these two will not last uh, for so long. And uh, eventually, Brown Mauzo and Vera Sidika did break up. Now, apart from that, um, we, we have so many talk of uh, director Trevor and Eve Mungai, you know. Especially the moment uh, when Eve Mungai started kind of selling nudity. Yeah, on the internet. Um, that is the point uh, when Andrew Kibbe knew that uh, things are heading south. Now, uh, for comedian YY, it is alleged that uh, the breakup was as a result of uh, the DNA test that uh, revealed that the daughter, comedian YY, has been thinking to be his daughter, wasn't. It uh, showed otherwise that um, it belongs to somebody else. The results were not his. You know, they did not match. So, the question is, who's the biological father to the comedian YY's daughter? The only secret that um, can be revealed out can be through Maria. The only true results to this is Maria herself. Who knows? This was a result of uh, online pressure from fans uh, who said, like, hey, this daughter does not look like um, comedian YY. The daughter looks so much like a friend of YY. And who's this? Eddie Butita. I'm not insinuating that Butita is the dad, but um, because of that pressure, you know, it forced uh, comedian YY to actually conduct a, a DNA test to prove. Uh, that uh you know is that her real daughter so whether it's a kipindi or a drama let us wait and see maybe they'll be back together maybe not let us wait and see to get to know if nikipindi wanna piga or actually it's true that they have uh, really broken up okay number two the pluto the sanitizer himself, the man who's responsible for so many relationship breakups. Finally, they do say what goes around comes back around. Now, <laughs> who expected that uh, this will also hit um, his door, especially after the success they've made together as, uh, you know, the Pluto and Felicity Shiro. Nobody ever imagined that the two would, you know, break up. But anyway, just like any other relationship, they were vulnerable, I believe, ups and downs. And finally, he also confirmed through his Instagram that they have finally decided to go on their separate ways and end their three-year relationship. This is one relationship that also Andrew Kibbe did predict back then that uh, they will break up. Yeah. Because, uh, I don't know, sometimes it's infatuation or lust that takes people to these kind of relationships, but after some time they realize that um, love isn't in it. So, 
let us wait and see so the pluto announces breakup with girlfriend felicity shiro and uh, we've decided to go on our separate ways and end our three-year relationship uh, guys what do you think about this is it also a kipindire or <laughs> something is just uh, happening wrong is it drama is it the uh, normal uh, showbiz uh, or you know the normal uh, gigs that we know we, we call them um kiki unadhania ni kiki ama unadhania ni kweli kwamba wameza kuachana so right away now the third one is kind of uh, painful but anyway if it's true <laughs> i mean Sometimes you may never know what ladies uh, really want. Now Juliani and Lilian Nganga have also separated. You know, this has been seen uh, by the actions that uh, the two have taken uh, with regards to the uh, social media accounts. Whereby we can see Juliani has decided to delete uh, Lilian's uh, photos, and uh, also uh, Lilian has also decided to delete Juliani's uh, photos. But so Juliani has removed the recent ones but kept group photos for instance um, the photos that they've taken with um, people like Boniface Mwangi moments with their kids and picture from uh, uh, 2 years ago um he's decided to retain them i don't know uh, the reason for him deleting others and leaving others maybe for memory but also the others were also for memory but i don't know if the ones that he's deleted are having so nice memories that um, may uh, result to him not healing so fast but i don't know for them also i don't know whether it's a kipindi or not but remember when um it was alleged that uh, lilian nganga left uh, the uh, former machakos governor alfred mtua uh, because alfred mtua one wasn't a present uh, personality most of the time he was busy so and you know like uh, the ladies demand lots of attention from their guys now uh another thing was a very controversial one when um, it was said uh, maybe the former governor wasn't good in bed you know so finally the lady decided to go to someone who was good in bed who was giuliani so people are saying like you know you are from a frying pan direct to fire that's the best description that the online uh, citizens are making of so it is alleged uh, that um, now lilian nganga has cheated with a butcherman i don't know which butcherman so from former governor to Giuliani, from Giuliani now to this butcherman. Who might be the butcherman? Does he seem to have more, I don't know, more bonga points, uh, you know, than uh, the previous uh, dudes, uh, than Giuliani, than the former governor? I mean, what is Lillian looking for in a man? What kind of attention is he looking for? You know, they will say it's too difficult to understand what a woman really wants and it's also very difficult to satisfy a woman because even the creator himself the women feel there are certain things that um, he didn't accomplish in them a woman is someone who will cut their nails and go buy stickers to put a woman is someone who will shave their eyebrows and go get other ones to uh, they will shave their eyelashes and go get uh, artificial ones and fix so <laughs> satisfying a woman is so difficult my friend so do what you can do but um i don't believe it's no longer uh, anything to do with cash I, I i'm so convinced right now um women actually i know some do go for cash but uh um, whenever they get that cash they're never satisfied they also look for something else so satisfying women is very difficult so boy child you better get wise and wise and wise as time goes to get to understand uh, uh, these uh, uh, daughters uh, of uh, you know of eve uh, you, you you get to understand them daughters of jezebel i don't know what they really want
Yeah, maybe if they'll open up and tell us like, hey, this is because as it is, there is no manual. There is no manual of how to court these ladies. There is no manual of how to take them towards the rights. Because look, in a month, three couples have already broken up. Talk of YY and Myra. Talk of the Pluto and um, uh, Felicity Shiro. Talk of um, Giuliani and Lilian Nganga. I mean, what is it that um, they are not getting that they have to you know, break up? D does it mean that, yes, there is money, but again, there is no peace? Uh, is it that um, there is um, satisfaction in the bedroom, but again, uh, there is no attention? Is it that, uh, you know, but again, you know, in this world, uh, you cannot uh, garner everything that you really want. Hey, this syllabus is rushing so fast. Aye, atami mwenye na shindo kuyelewa. <laughs> with a for the unscripted talks here in Dub Radio. If you love content of this nature kindly and you're watching from our YouTube channel, please uh, subscribe, press the notification button so anytime that we are live, you'll be the very first person to be notified or anytime that we upload our content. If you're watching from Facebook, kindly follow our Facebook page. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu. Dub Radio, your ultimate experience. Peace out. Kwa timba kali za Afrika, Dab Radio ndio mpango mzima.